Hi guys, welcome back to ADSR FMH Tutorials. This is the final part of the feature we've been doing this month, looking at the envelopes in FMA. I'm going to show you how to make that sound we have playing there. That's making use of the operator envelopes, the filter envelope, and the pitch envelope. So let's go ahead and create a new sound here and just get this sound together with the FM matrix and the operators and do some stuff in the master section and then we'll get into the envelopes. So going to use five operators for this sound, operators B through to F and they're all going to be routed through the filter so let's turn all that stuff on and F's routing through the filter at full volume and it's going to be a temp format waveform and we're going to drop the ratio down to 0.25 so it drops it down a couple of octaves there, I'm going to key sync this operator as well Operator re next, route that to the filter at full volume 100, keep it as a sine wave, set the ratio to 0.5, so down one octave, key synced. Push that cutoff up for now. And operator D now, this can stay as a sine wave, key synced, full volume again, and the ratio now is 0.75 bit of a chord thing going now, operator C, full volume and 1.25 on the ratio, so enhancing that chord sound, key synced and four format waveform, so something with a little bit more grit than the sine waves. And operator B finally, key sync this and I'm going to take the ratio right up to six and I'm going to use B to feed into operator F. It's giving us quite a nice tone on the sound. I'm also going to route it to the filter, but not a full volume, about half volume, so around about 50. So, quite a nice start to the sound. Let's just increase the voices to two, make it monophonic. So that I detune off and push this digital slider up. So we're getting a bit of that bit, bit crushing going on. So about three quarters of the way on that digital. So now with that sound set up, let's move to these envelopes. And as we've discussed in the previous tutorials, we can link our envelopes together, especially for the operators. So all of these operators we set up here, let's link the envelopes together so they're locked together. And let's make them all tempo synced. And we're gonna set an envelope loop range of 3 over 8 here, so as obviously I zoom out, that's 1 bar, so it's a 1 bar loop range, so then we've got half bar, and we could go quarter bar, but if we go 3 over 8, we're going to get a bit of a triplet like feel on this envelope loop that we set up, so drag this end point out to the 3 over 8, and with it tempo synced, it's going to snap to that 3 over 8, check the mode now to fixed from slide, now it's fixed, we've got this loop point set up, uh, let's add another point in here, control click in this area, we're getting this dotted line now, so we're now getting a sustained loop, and let's drag this over to the start here, double click on the envelope, so it kind of just shows the full envelope in one screenshot, let's drag that point over to the start, add another point, so what we want is the sharp attack, and then it to kind of bend down, so another point in here, bend down to round around just after the 1 over 8 so we get this let's push this slope up so let's put another point in here so but I want this to have a sharp this second point I want this to have a sharper attack click again and let's straighten this up and bring the sustain the decay of this second point down. Put that release out a little bit. Make sure this is snapped to one of these points here, so it's on the six over thirty-two. So that should be all right. That should that should sync up. Let's 
let's just play that with the loop with a beat so we know that it's kind of sinking in time okay so that's all right there so the what MIDI I've got here is just the one a long sustained C3 note it's looping over eight bars and so if we move now to the filter section I'm going to set up an eight bar loop on this filter loop here so set this filter up I'm going to take the cutoff down to zero filter one push the resonance up to around halfway keep the mode on low pass filter two take the spread up to 100 Keep the resonance at zero, the mode on low pass, the routing can all stay the same, and this envelope amount, let's push this up to 100. And now let's set up an envelope for this filter. So tempo syncs again, and the mode on slide. I want to drag the endpoint out to the eight. Here. So I've set up an eight bar loop for this filter envelope now. Check the mode back to fixed. And what I want to do is, as we sustain a note, the sound to kind of sweep down as if a low pass filter has been applied to it and then sweep back up again. So in order to do this, control click once and we've set up our envelope loop. Drag this over to the start here. Add another point in here. And now add another point we're going to hear this sound if we sustain a note now we're going to hear this sound kind of like sweep down and then it jumps back up but let's make this kind of jump back up a little bit more subtle so now as we sustain a note it's going to it's basically like the filter is sweeping down and then sweeping back up again the note sustained so it sweeps back up in the next four bars and what I want to do is enhance that a bit further as we had that loop playing there so in the last four bars as the sound sweeps up the pitch rises up as well so a quick way of applying a pitch envelope in here let's save this filter envelope this filter envelope has been set to, to loop over eight bars let's save this in an empty envelope slot if we can Let's go to this pitch envelope here, tempo sync this, and load up that same envelope. So what we can do now is apply an envelope amount of 50, so we're going to get a more pronounced pitch slide on this sound, and listen to what we've done there. Still sustaining the note, and then it rises up. What I wanted to do with the sound, I didn't really want it to have that pitch sliding down at the start. So let's keep the mode on fixed here. Let's just highlight this point, this first envelope node. And let's take the level to zero. So that means the pitch is preserved at the start of the sound. So and it sweeps down. keep sustaining the nose it sweeps back up the filter opens and the pitch rises at the same time and then it loops back round again so let's finish this sound off now and apply some effects go to the effects section bit of overdrive push the drive up push the tone up to full and the bass as well bit of shelving EQ a bit of peak EQ boosting some kind of subs or lows maybe a little bit of high frequency as well Get the volume a bit as well and finally some reverb that bright up and maybe pull the time down and that's our sound put together there let's have a little listen
Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. I hope you've enjoyed the feature we've done this month on the envelopes in FM8. Any questions, please get in touch, let us know. Get yourself over to our website as well, fm8tutorials.com. Tons more tutorials on there featuring FM8. And thanks for watching. All right, cheers. Bye.